People gathered tonight in downtown Rogers to honor military veterans. Art on the Bricks is hosted monthly by downtown Rogers, but this month is dedicated to veterans. 5 News reporter Rachel Williams gives us a closer look. Downtown Rogers Art partnered with the VA hospital in Fayetteville to highlight art by veterans of the military. Every month we like to have something that's either socially significant or culturally significant, so we do that with the veterans every year. Organizers say veterans' mental health can be improved by art and music. This event allows them a chance to connect with the community and showcase their work. Some of them also have PTSD, and they are learning that art helps them cope with the PTSD, helps them with emotional um, struggles that they might have, and it also gives them a chance to be out in the community and people to show appreciation not only for their art but also for their service. And the 17 veterans who are taking part this year have created some amazing crafts, everything from paintings, sculptures, and jewelry. I have severe depression and uh, severe anxiety and PTSD. And uh, I, I didn't want to paint at first, and uh, I just decided to, and I just uh, liked it from that day forward. That day was April 1st. He painted for the first time and couldn't stop. It makes me happy, and uh, I just get in a whole different world. And uh, so, uh, and I'm, 100% better than I was uh, for the last 10 years. Not only does David struggle with anxiety and depression, but he's also colorblind. But that doesn't stop him from creating colorful art. I watched some, uh, um, a couple of videos on people painting, mm -hmm. and I thought, well, that's pretty cool. I'll try that. At Thursday's event, David shared his story, hoping other veterans will use art as a form of therapy. It may not be painting, but they could find something that does the same thing for them. And uh, hopefully they have the same results that I have had. In Rogers, covering news where you live, Rachel Williams, 5 News.